Hi guys, and welcome back to our channel. We are back, and Camper's really excited yes, about that. Yeah. Today, we are so excited because you guys are gonna be controlling our date night. We're gonna be posting a bunch of polls on Instagram, and we're just gonna listen to exactly what you guys want us to do tonight. Are you excited? I'm very excited. Just don't mess this up, okay? Don't mess this Make up. It a it's, great our, night. it's our date night. Yes. Also, our sponsor for today's video is perfect because we are working with F. TD flowers. Let me just show you. So Marcus and I picked these out together. Actually, we got two bouquets. Is it bouquet or bouquet? Don't quote me on it, but I think it's bouquet. Okay. It might just be the Marcus version. <laughs> okay, well, we got two floral arrangements. Here is one of our bouquets that we got from FTD Flowers. Oh. They actually offer handcrafted bouquets and they're hand delivered by local florists and oh they just help you say I love you to the loved one in your life. Did this so, help you? Oh, it helped me, babe. It really helped. We also have this beautiful one. And Not I can't, one, but two. Yeah, I can't decide which one I like better. I feel like... You don't have to. You can have both. Okay, thank you, me so you. so much. These are so perfect, especially with Valentine's Day coming up. You can surprise your loved one early with some beautiful flowers. I really like this bouquet because it's like the classic Valentine's Day roses. Just, you can never go wrong with this type. But I feel like I'm more drawn to this bouquet because it's a little more like wild flower. It has a bunch of different flowers going on, but they have so many different options. There's definitely one for anybody out there. So if you guys want to save 20% on your bouquets, just go to ftd.com. And I'll have the link down in my description box. Well, what's better than a lovely bouquet? Nothing, absolutely. A, a lovely kiss. I don't just know if the kidding, flowers are looking kidding. better than that. <laughs> okay, God. first poll coming right up. Are you nervous, Mr. Cheese? It can be kind of crazy. I think it'd be very fun if we ended up at a club tonight. <laughs> That's my worst nightmare. I want to get put out of our like comfort zone tonight. Well, we'll see. Have we ever been to a club together? Never. All right, we should say go to the club. <laughs> That's what it Where is even a club? Uh, babe, this is LA, dude. It's filled with clubs. <laughs> okay, I did the first poll. Okay. Okay, I said, should we dress up fancy and cute or comfy and casual? And the vote is in. Okay. 67% said dress up, 33% said comfy clothes. So, All right, you know what that means. Ready? Yeah, like our TikTok. <laughs> Marcus is so dressed up, now I feel dressed down. When do I have the shot to wear this funky blue? Dude, where are you going, to a hoedown? I wore this because you liked when I wore lace white dresses. Sick, dude. I say we go ride a bull at the hoedown. <laughs> We should say, should we go to a fast food restaurant or a nice restaurant? Because what if we go to like McDonald's okay, or In-N-Out? Yeah. Well, where are we going to eat, guys? Is it fast food or is it five star, my guys? Let's see. Oh, oh my. It has shifted. Wow. They're really making us spend the big bucks tonight. 72% say five star. I'm talking Michelin tires five stars. That's what I want. This place says it has two Michelin stars. Oh, that's right, they only go up to three stars. It's like weird, it's not normal. It's disgust over Yeah, okay. it's, and it's five stars and four money signs. Okay, sick. There's no way we're getting a reservation for this. Let's see. Okay. Hi, do you guys have any availability for tonight for two people? How many people? Two. Uh, we do, so if you're looking to join us as soon as possible, we have a people now available for you. Oh, perfect. Okay, we need to go now. Let's 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 now ask Instagram how we should get there. Bike. <laughs> should we do? Babe, I can't bike. Yeah, you can. You're gonna put on some leggings and we'll throw them in the backpack. And then we'll... Should we ride our electric bike there, or should we drive there like normal humans? No. What? Fifty fifty right now. Then we can drive halfway in the car, bring the bike, and then drive halfway to the restaurant. That is true. That would be smart. Because I keep refreshing, it's still 50-50. We're loading in the bike. We'll see if it fits. We're on our way to this restaurant, bundled up, because we are going to get on the bike in about five minutes. But I was looking on Yelp, and basically this place has like a tasting menu, and it's 
the least amount of money you can possibly spend there is $120 per person. That's expensive for all. You guys chose it, so you better thumbs up, subscribe, and support our channel. Let's go. We're halfway to the restaurant, so we switched to the bike, and it's freezing. It's freezing out here. We're bundled up, but we only have about a 10 minute ride to get there, so we'll be there soon. Go for it. My mouth is exploding with flavors I've never known could happen before. Okay, this is our first course. And to watch these little things wiggle and dance around. That's a course. <laughs> this is a forest. This is a log with some moss and rocks. <laughs> <laughs> That's so good. Yeah. So strange, but so good. We just got done at dinner. It was very good. There was tiny portions, but there was a ton of tiny portions. Also, that was the most expensive dinner I have ever Most had. expensive dinner I've ever had. Bougie, oh one of the gosh. bougiest places in terms of service, like every five minutes coming to scrape off the crumbs. Yeah, at the beginning of the dinner, we ordered oh. and then Marcus goes, um, <laughs> sir, are there sides, if you will? <laughs> like, why did you say, if you will? Because like, I, you was like, I was like, I was looking for fancy. words. Yeah, I was looking for words. And I was like, I don't know what word it means to ask for. Is there French fries with this fish, please? Or potatoes or something? Because I don't want three different oh. pieces of fish and that's it. So I was like, are there, um, and I was like, crap, what am I going to say? And I went, sides if you will <laughs> now we're gonna ask you guys where we should go for dessert even though Instagram. we had a dessert at dinner yeah we had like a tiny bite of dessert at dinner mm, banana -y. but we're ready for a full dessert my question to you guys was should we get ice cream or should we get donuts 56% of you said ice cream and 44% of you said donuts yeah so we're gonna go get ice cream even though it's 53 degrees outside and i think we're gonna ride our bike over there we are riding the bike we're parking the car oh. and we're riding the bike um, do you guys have right, we don't know if you guys are conspiring together to make it super hard where we have to get both options every time but somehow you've picked 50 50 <laughs> the two different types of ice cream. So here so we go. we got strawberry sorbet and mint chocolate chip. Cheese. Boink. Do you think that ice cream sales go up or down when it's cold outside? They go down when it's cold outside. They go up. That's what my mom told me. She heard what? a statistic that more ice cream is sold when it's cold outside than when it's warm. Why? I don't know. Where? I don't know. I feel like a dweeb in Why? this suit. I don't know. It's very funky. And it's kind of like, I feel like people are looking at me like, why is this guy wearing like it a suit as though extra. he's in the news, you know? I look like I'm like a zany newscaster, like, and that's the weather, John! <laughs> yes! <laughs> I used to be obsessed with the Weather Channel when I was a preteen. Every day I would watch the Weather Channel because I wanted to know if it was going to rain. And then I got, serious? yes, and then scared? I watched so much Weather Channel and then I started watching Storm Stories and all of their original content and it's like, whatever but like i watched the weather channel straight up like i was a fan of the weather channel uh, isn't that did weird did you ever want to become a newscaster for a little bit i was like oh i could be a storm chaser okay our next decision was should we go bowling or marcus's idea to go to a western bar and go ride a mechanical bull <laughs> ride the bull has 61 and bowling has 39. oh i knew it all right, we are walking to this place where they have the mechanical bull, and we're gonna see who gets on. Guys, we just walked in there. There are so many people watching, and that bull is violent, and I don't want to do it. Babe, obviously you're the girl, and everyone I wants to see that. I do it. Well, I've already ridden the bull. Because you, because How did you, you do when you rode it? I've been here before. Listen, because you're so reluctant to, <laughs> that everyone wants you to see. So it. Everyone wants to see you now because you're making okay, a huge bit about it. Okay, let's do a poll. Should Marcus ride it or me ride it? We're gonna do the poll. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's over. <laughs> Seventy-six percent of her. She's freaking riding you got that bull. Twenty-six percent riding. Let's go. Come on, I gotta sign you up. <laughs> 
We have one more poll to ask you guys, and that is, should we watch a movie or should we go in the hot tub? What are you hoping for? I was hoping for a movie. <laughs> I was hoping for hot tub, actually. Okay. Well, 71% of people say hot tub. 29% oh. of people say watch a movie. So get your suit on. It's already on, baby. I've been ready. We don't know why, but our hot tub is in like a weird party mode. I haven't this been able to figure it out. This is the club for the night. Yeah, right? This do, is our do, club. Do, 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 do. I feel like we haven't hot tubbed in a while. We haven't. It's been months. When it's this cold outside, it's kind of like unappetizing because you know when you get out, it's going to be freezing. Yes. I feel like we haven't had a date like this ever where we just went and did do so things. much stuff. It's good. We needed this, I think. And I think this is where we're going to end this video, guys. And if you liked it, please give it a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Oh, hello. Is Hi, it focusing? Focus. We also want to say a big thank you to FTD Flowers for sponsoring this video. We love you guys so much. And we will see you soon. Bye. Bye.